I'm going to make use of the fact that this takes forever to load to ask something. How come is it that, you know, the Takao still hasn't done a sort of uh, Mario Brothers X project yet, you know? I mean, um... Like... And, but that, that's that's basically the thing, is that every time I'm playing in the, the end game of these games, I'm like, man, I'm really curious to see what a talk house could do. I know that there was that whole let's redo some Bex project, but I don't see how that's necessary, you know? Like, why reinvent the wheel? Just to do, like, a little stupid game, like a sort of ASMT Zero prelude to the stupid, and just... I know, the worst case, piggyback on the, um... On the, the, the special engine used to make this, to make the Talking Time Brothers, if we want to know a little bit more level availability, I don't know what I'm saying, but I just don't see why everything always has to get so complicated whenever the idea comes to do a thing. Regardless, hey there everyone, this is Cow playing Talking Time Brothers, super. Last time, this felt like the last level of the Turbo Zone, but there's still a few things left, such as having a wonderful time by Donnie. I don't know if that's sarcastic or if it's just, you know, an excuse to use this particular song, considering this seems to be a bunch of coins and very little else. Um, yeah, this is a, it's a very difficult level. Oh, gee. <laughs> now you're just straight out telling me, you know what? Just destroy the world. The world is there for your destruction. Please do not despair. I have to leave some of them alive so that they can, you know, remind others of the tale. You know, that's just being humane, yo. Here I can fly over lava. It's pretty way Blark doesn't know what the hell. That's a lot of lava just kind of being there. I managed to die in this level of all things. Oh man, I reclaimed the life I lost. That's surprising. <laughs> all these lives wasted. It's kind of sad. Uh, look at all those poor lives. I, I could have gone that, that power up and killed those cows, but not that. It's not that big of a difference. This time, uh, no survivors. They have time to tell the tale. No, they have time to recalculate entirely. So uh, g g g that goes to show what happens uh, if you dare find some clemency. See in your uh, heart. So this time, fly real high, because apparently this is just long enough for the blue thing to last. Or more, I guess I was just taking my time a bit more, and just kind of destroying the world. <laughs> you know, in case you had trouble farming for lives in this game yet, we're giving you this tool here, right, Blarg? You're not Blarg at all, you're Thwomp. How did I, how did I do that? I really do don't know. Hey there, Thwomp, how's it going? Do you want to fall in the lava? I think that you do. You're just not aware of it, but that's pretty swell. If I wanted to, I could just, you know, do it normally. I don't know why there's two of them. That looks kind of... Oh man, now I've got, you know, death implement. Let us destroy a fish or two. Whoa, whoa, whoa there, lingering fish. Please restrain from going back, because instead I want you to go dead. And I can fly! It's pretty great. Can I have a shoe? And then I guess not. I guess we're going to go down because it doesn't fly good enough. And I guess I was uh, like a bit of a sort of a sort of filtration. Hey there, Bowser Pit! How's it going down there? I see there's a nostril too! Toad, how do you feel about that? Yes, it doesn't. Hey there, Toad, how's it going? <laughs> Oh man, that's the joke. You always gonna spell it out for the people in the back seats. That because of the difference in the how, you know, the lag when the when the time gets displaced, that was clear. The end and credits. Hmm, that sounds so I did finish the game yesterday by accident. I feel kind of bad. That's the end! There's Yoshi... There's Toad, for some reason. I... Oh man, I love the use of the bomb as firecrackers. I are a... Oh man, I wonder what I am. A SUP! Heck yeah! Oh, I'm a super! Heck yeah! I totally am R, and I won first place. It's pretty great. 
Lung is in third place where he belongs. Because I'm a super player, it says so in coins. And also to it with Mario Kart music. Congratulations! I've saved the princess, the star. Well, it would be over except now there's an expansion pack. <laughs> Well, it was really great playing it. It's kind of too bad that I'm not done playing it. <laughs> and what's this about here? So that would be the credits. Whom are we to blame for this video? Of so that's how Talking Time Brother Form looks like. Okay. <laughs> there's a big old skull thing and there's a sniffet. Action Dan is a sniffet. There's like an, an infinite amount of text you can have in these levels compared to world. And you know, I'm really- Oh man, there's Fancy Crab Man. That sounds like a good idea. Whoa! Rosencrantz, what are you doing here? You should be waiting around. This is why I like to play collab projects, because it's so rare that they get done. <laughs> right, ninjas? Oh man, Super Mario. Oh boy, L, you have a lot to say. Uh, wow. Well, well, okay, well, oh, well, I don't know, man. That's a lot. Did like the do 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 do? I'm making mouth sounds. It's pretty great, and you're fairly, you know. Is a wall. He is a wall. It's pretty great. Giant head is actually a giant back. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Oh man, there is water with a guy that kind of looks like a squid. This other squid looks less like a squid. And he goes blah bob. And there's a crab. His name is Demir. And after your analysis, I agree. There's... Oh! Tournament Edition Ryan comes from the store to Travesty, apparently. That's pretty hilarious. And there's Kirby with low resolution. There's where Zambabar is. There's a sign. Okay, and there's the guy that gets killed of his parents in the video game based webcomic. Okay, well actually this game was not to the stick in the slightest, dude. <laughs> wow, you're weird. So this works a lot more than the Cafe O Cameo in that, uh, in the uh, production. Because you're allowed to actually have more than one people say stuff. Forgot why well, a lot of your levels were guys in this thing. <laughs> well, at least you're aware of it. Is that a character or is it a door? Because I don't know what's going to happen. I'm going to grab this thing, and I want to go back to si Ah! Well, I didn't lose a life, so it's okay. But I want to see what up with the door, man. There's a door there. Oh, you get a 1-up right at the start, too, so you're sure to survive that. That's actually kind of clever. Thank you very much. And see here, there's like even a shortcut. This is not an action-filled video for a lot of yous. This is a door with more peeps! Oh, that's for the expansion! Kayan! Oh man, we're going to play some Kayan levels in the expansion very well. You remind me of all those terrible fan comics in Bob and George. And there's Cherno! Hey there, Cherno! You are represented by a number. Well, I guess the safest, best way to get out of here is to get killed by Percy's flaming yo. Except my life counter there didn't go down. So do I zoom on right now to the expansion first? There's the rainbow pipe I have to get into that exists at the start of this carousel of madness. What does this lead us today to here? Oh, it's just a turn into everything zone. Oh, I see. Well, I'm not gonna take anything though, man, because I'm gonna be not complaining to come to do. This has been 10 minutes yet, yeah? maybe slightly less if I edit some out of my second run of It's a Wonderful Zone Place, and we haven't done anything, it's pretty great. Good timing with yesterday's recording there, Valcow. Expansion night. 
with uh, what sounds like Kirby's Dream Course music. World E! Okay, we got a name. Okay, fair enough. There's a selection of one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so it's a f somewhat of a full-fledged level. Not with the light here, in case you absolutely need it. Okay... And there's another secret level somewhere too. Well, in the bush. <laughs> it's in the bush, guys! So let's at least do one real level here to formulate an agenda or something. In Start World E, The Great Escape. Let us go, my grapefield friend. Playing as Peach! Oh man! Oh man! <laughs> Everyone's a boss. He's very nice. Oh, that's neat though. If we basically end up doing like a castle. Le yeah, we're basically ending up, I think, doing 1-1 um, one -one backwards. That's kind of clever. These should be invisible. Well, it's not, yeah, it's not a real actual castle. It's not 1-1. One -one. It's just based on a true castle, but you know it's inspired by, it's not the actual thing. I really like Peach, um, overall. Like, I know she's just this base, I don't know. There's, I guess we're continuing with the game here, it's pretty great. Wanna get the flag, but I can't hear there, Percy, how's it going? <laughs> oh jeez, what? Whoa, okay, that's kind of a... Blind jumps with Peach are scary because she can blind her way fairly far. And she holds shells over her head because she's a lady. That's the proper way to hold a, a thing that is the size of your torso. I guess if you have very strong shoulders, which all women have compared to men, I have been led to believe. Dang fish, you exist everywhere except in my head. And I'm free to be the princess everywhere, but a turn. the cause of my death at one point. I like her bouncy balls fire. See, that's why pe Man, that's a lot of fish. Y'all all a lot of fish. You are all all a lot of fish. Oh man, I'm, pr I'm supposed to use uh, MC Hammer there to destroy the world, but I did a fairly bad job at it. How is it going? It's pretty great. So this is world... I guess now we're going to one, two. Well, whichever world this is to. There's a sky pipe for some reason. Hey there, midpoint. How's it going? Can we go to the warp zone? That feels appropriate. Look, actually looks like we sorta of can. What did I just do here? Hey there, buddy, how's it going? Alright, I'm putting myself to warp zone! I can swim instead of being in the lava cave. It has no lava. Because the bricks are all like lava bricks that have cooled down since the 90s, which is more than understandable, if you will permit me to say. Hey there, Blooper, how's it going? You look like a very friendly little element of pain. Hey there, 1-Up, how's it going? I really need you guys. I need all the 1-Ups that I can. Hey there, Percy. You are a guy, and your face... Well, actually, I'm not sure why I'm being so friendly with you, considering I have just had pro proofs that, that you are an aberration of nature, but there you go anyways. We're we are now in uh, stage one of whatever world this is. It's a level that's advanced enough world for Hammer Brothers, so it's at the very least world three. Except it's shaped a lot to remind us of world one. What is going on? I don't know, I am getting kind of a World 3 vibe, especially maybe because it's night time. That's possible, right Mr. Goomba? You are now flat, it's pretty great. Man, you guys speak a lot! <laughs> oh man, that's pretty great! Uh, I agree! 
I've got to go to the party stuff land. Hooray! Man, my proofs are getting overwhelming in my pockets. Oh, I don't know. I'd rather have prayed to the flesh god myself. This is a video... This is a video game reference. It's pretty great. This is a terrible blood sacrifice! Well, I don't know. Can I participate? <clears throat> oh man! I want to throw a brick at your head to participate! Ah... Uh, darn gosh it. You guys don't seem to realize that, uh, you know, I've kind of freed your sacrifice over there. That's okay, I s- Oh gosh! What have I just done? I've, I've just committed, like, genocide here. I mean, sure, it was to save one dude. Was it worth it to save one dude uh, by killing, like, a million? According to this game's logic, yes, yeah, so I'll go with it. This is how Cow playing the literally post-game of Super Mario Brothers Talking Time, and uh, join me next time when hopefully there'll be more actual gameplay in the video and stuff, you know, like stuff. I like stuff. <laughs>